Now, there's more than 4,000 people um, in our county. The county that I live in is actually the largest county area-wise in the state of North Carolina. So the total population in the county is about 60,000. However, it can actually take you two hours to drive from one end of the county to the other. That's how big it is. Um, so I sat there, uh, you know, I probably spent two weeks in my spare time typing in my little database and I would put the doctor's name, their contact information, um, and just for my own information, their specialty. Um, and, you know, I started looking for um, research articles that would, that suited their specialty. Now, you know, a general practitioner, anything. You know, it could be, I mean, how many, how many folks are with fibromyalgia, that's usually where they go. Anybody that has any problem, you know, even if they need a specialist, they generally have to go to their GP first to get referred to that. So, um, I put their specialty on my database just as kind of a little information for myself. Um, and then I started looking for some research articles. I composed a letter to these doctors um, introducing myself and introducing our, our practice in Rutherfordton. Um, I actually held an open house for doctors and in my letter I put that, you know, if you're not able to make it to our open house, please feel free to drop in and see us at any time. I made it very clear that, um, that we would be happy to, you know, show them around, talk to them, answer questions or whatever. Um, at any time that they could fit us into their busy schedule. And you know what, the day after I sent this letter out, I started getting phone calls. Uh, and you know, normally it would not be the doctor we called, it would be their secretary or, or their head nurse or whatever. And the first call was, um, now you're not expecting us to, to do anything for you, are you, other than just send people there? You're not thinking we're going to file your insurance or anything, right? And I said, no, all I want is for you to refer people to me. And, you know, nine years later, uh, for every referral, the doctor still gets a thank you note from me. Thank you for referring so-and-so to our practice. I have let all of the physicians know, um, you know, that we keep detailed soap notes on people. And um, I have ascertained which of those would like to receive progress notes. I always ask them, do you want the progress notes on these folks? Um, you know, generally, if it's, if it's kind of an open-ended prescription of, you know, send Mary Jones massage for stress or whatever, then they don't care so much. If they're using it for some, you know, recommending for some sort of injury, rehabilitation, then they may want that documented and sent back to them, and that's fine. So we always go with whatever, uh, whatever the doctor wants. But that is how I came to be interested in this. I want to make it very clear I am not a researcher by anyone's stretch of the imagination. Um, 